Welcome down to another series of In The Rough with Liam and John. Today we've got a legend. This is Phil Dodd. Dodd? Yeah. Dodd! Dodd! Sorry, <laughs> Phil Ken Dodd! <laughs> anyway, we're at his own course, Congleton Golf Club in Cheshire. And it's going to be 2v1. Phil's off 14, John's off 15. They're going to take me on 2v1. No shots. They're going to play like Texas Scramble, where they'll both tee off, pick the best drive, and they'll both have a shot from there. And we're going to ask Phil some interesting questions. But we've also got a lot more stars coming on, haven't we? We certainly have, Liam. We've got uh, plenty of footballers, plenty of ex-golfers. Exciting times ahead. Phil, odd or even? Even. It is? We should go first. On the tee first, John or Phil? <laughs> Right, so red flags, nine old course, 5,000 yard. What a shot. Get Just left of the pin. Have you zoomed in on that, Presley? That's Pres a dis <laughs> Come here. <laughs> <laughs> what are you laughing at? I don't need to go, do I? <laughs> I don't need to play. This is, I I'm gobsmacked here. Right, John, what are you going? What was that you hit then, Phil? A time. A time, solid. Right, I think I'm, I'm going to go. I'm dropping back for one. The wind's picking up now. Wind is picking up. And there's no pressure on you, John. I'm putting from about 12 feet. <laughs> come on, Stop back. Stop it. On. Come on. Stop come it. Look at the wind bringing no. him in. He ain't come bunker. back. Bunker, I think. Back bunker, that? No. I think it's this one. I think the wind's got it. Yeah. I'm going to get another club. What are you playing hey. with, Liam? Yeah. Hey. Did you notice Phil got to that tee dead quick? He knew it was coming. Phil, what we're playing for? Yeah. Fiver. Fiver. No. The pressure's on here. We're, we're yeah, it's ten. Presley, yeah. what are you thinking of that shot of Phil's then? It's ten. Ten? Five each. So, what? in a minute. What do I get if I win then? Five. 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 <laughs> <laughs> Don't work, <does> it? <laughs> <laughs> This is what we do when we're playing with an alien. We've all got to go to one side when John's on the ball and back over here. What do you got, Liam? I, I, I've got nine, but I'm like... You concentrate on your shot. Well, I can't in this, but look at the grin on him. All right, come on, Liam. You've got to win one. Oh, he's pushed that. He's pushed that. That could be bunker. Go. That could be bunker. Oh, in, in between. between. In between. Yeah, they missed that. Well, it's shot not... down. That wind got more than you think, you know. I didn't catch it. I, I, I'm in bit of... <laughs> Still. <laughs> I think I might... You know them questions we've got written down? I think I might start how long has he been playing golf for? Four and telling everyone 14. Right, golf mates, it's going to be a tricky one, this. Pace-wise, I think about you and drop it's it. Very in. serious, this. Yeah, but yeah, even there, there, yeah, yeah, because it's going to drop down into. How serious is this? So, like, come on, lads. It's a tough putt. Yeah, yeah. Phil, putt, are you this. saying this is a horrible chip? No. I have to get within no, don't, a foot. Don't say anything. If I get within a foot, he won't give it me. How's don't that? If I get within a foot, I'll give it you. Don't say anything to me because it just. As long right as it's a Phil put. It just encourages them. This is down. Scared. Now he's got a tough butt down here, hasn't he? Oh no, Liam, Liam, don't give these to us. It's like playing age concern. They'll not hear that until they watch this video, will they? I think here, John, this could be short because you're frightened of it, aren't you? That's not bad. I'll tell you what. Wow, good effort, that. Good effort. Oh, I was giving it that and it just went past the circle of love. Just went past the circle of love. Scared of that. I got behind it thinking I've got to put it there and let it come down. That'd be impossible in summer, wouldn't it? Not hard enough. Never hit it enough. Ah, John, John. Get in. I'm going to have it out. Out now. Without being horrible, I've got the thing where I have no choice. I have to make this putt, because you two will make I that think. one. So am I coming from Phil's yeah. putt then? Oh, yeah. are you? Yeah. OK, that's fine. I think. Getting not. better, isn't it, John? I think mm. these want to beat me. He was short earlier on, yeah. both ways. Do you want to beat me, Phil? Yeah, definitely. Well, John? Yeah. Without doubt. You've got to put this in. What did I say? What did I say? What did I say? Oh. I think you're still away there. Hey, nothing gas <laughs> past you, Sherlock. <laughs> <laughs> is that a little bite there? No. Where? He knows. I think we're in his head. <laughs> How many puts have we got for this? 
So I met Phil by chance, I went watching Bolton and Phil actually met him in uh, the Macron Suite, is it called, Macron John? Macron Suite, yeah. And he watches the channel, so <laughs> come on, Phil, get your par. Should we just lag it up? And I think John's got a question for you. Wonderful. Solid. Uh, Wonderful pot, let me get that for you. <laughs> is that uh, one up? It is. After one. Throughout your illustrious career as a referee, Phil, who was the hardest manager to referee? I, th I think it's got to be Ferguson, Sir Alex. Sir Alex? Yeah, he just used to get in your head at half time and you always said to yourself, no, he's not getting in my head. Come out in the second half, you do something, he's in the head. So tough. But he was, he could take a joke. I remember being at uh, Man United, was fourth official. And I think it was Wigan, half time, he came up the tunnel moaning we should have had more i think we played a minute we should have had two or three minutes so anyway i think they were winning one nil and uh he sent his uh, coach down how long left to tell him five that'll upset him i was only putting two up so i saw him t say to ferguson two and he's going, blah, 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 going absolutely busy and i thought i'm not saying anything i'll give him put the board up two come back he went <laughs> give me a load of stiff but you know it's a bit of fun saying that a bit of fun after the game did you always anticipate a knock on the door and he was, he was in just to question you? I could never, ever remember him coming in. Is that right? Yeah, never, ever. So he'd, he'd probably give you up the tunnel, but that was it, and then he'd just leave you alone. So it was tunnel and touchline? Yeah. And that was it? After the game, nothing was said? No, no. Who was the easiest then? I don't think any of them were easy. I thought they were all obviously up there for a reason, because the top managers. So I don't, I don't say I'd got in with anybody all, all that well. Sam Allardyce, when he was at Bolton, could be nice one minute and... Absolutely horrible the next. Depending on the scoreline. Yeah, normally, yeah. <laughs> I suppose that's all of them, isn't it? That's the nature of the beast, though, isn't it? I mean, you're always, you're going to feel aggrieved if your team's not doing well or not playing well, not winning. And consequently, if you haven't had decisions go your way, you're going to feel aggrieved. So you're always going to have somebody knocking on you. I suppose door. it's human nature. Blame somebody else instead of yourself. But again, though, Phil, going back to that, the benefit of a replay the benefit of watching it on TV, where you've got to make a split and decision. Slower, and slower. And a lot slower. It's, it, you know, things stand out more, don't they? Your angles, standing behind players. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I've, I've got to be honest, when I used to come home and I thought, well, maybe I got something wrong. I never used to watch Match of the Day. I used to be wait for people to tell me I'd got it wrong. Right. You know, I thought, but if I knew I'd got it right, I'd put it on. <laughs> well, hopefully you, you watched a lot of Match of Day, Phil. <laughs> did you used to look forward to the Sunday papers in the morning after a bad game? No, did I? No. There's been quite a few with uh, my name on them, and as I suppose yeah. we'll allude to later on. Yeah. Lowest handicap you got? 12, I think. As you can see, not very good. <laughs> oh, you have a surprise, right? Yeah. Par four, shot 300. That's That's it. It. What? Stay there, Phil, for there your shot trace for me. That. Brilliant shot. You have picked a right ringer, you. Oh, not Each, wrong. We were playing singles on the way down, and he went, what we'll do, we'll do some of a twist, like, I'll play with Phil, silent assassin. Good shot, mate. Steady Eddie. It's like old man Pat, he just goes bang, bang. I was lucky then. And he was just told us that last hole, he doesn't normally like it, but he has a hole-in-one on there. Have you had a hole-in-one, job? I've never had a hole-in-one, Liam. Never and Probably I. never looked like getting one either. Get away, both of you. Come on, come Fading. on. Left of that way it is. Come on. Bunker. Nope. No, I left think it's of past. it. I think that's past. How far is this all then, Phil? 300. Kind of about three from here, 330. Back this side, Phil. Are we going? <sighs> you could actually reach this. God, it's like a finger, this, like a yolo. Come to here, me, Phil. To you. It's like tennis, isn't it? <laughs> I reckon you could hit this screen. Phil, football fan? Yeah. Who's your team? Uh, Port Vale. Port I mean, Port Is it Bursum? Bursum? Burslem. Burslem, yeah, I remember. We used to have ding dongs with them. Futch, remember him? Who? Futch. Futcher. Yeah, Futcher. Old Eddie lad. It was like brothers though as well. There was Ron and Paul. Yeah, I remember that, but they were a winger. Borgie. Ian Borgie, Ian Borgie that was yeah. a player on a boat. Was, uh, the Geordie lad, wasn't yeah, it? Yeah, Geordie, yeah. He was a midfield player. Yeah, but he scored goals. He was with me, me at Millwall. Borgie. Was he? Yeah, great little player. Fantastic Everybody with you at Millwall. He was brilliant though. Pressure on. It is, yeah. We're in his head. We could go dormy to you, John. Oh, he's pushed that. Wind that could be in trouble. I think that could be past in trouble. Is it? Oh, I'm it's not past sure, the trees. Mate. There's Maybe a lake, water. We <laughs> might be all right, mate. We might find it. Thanks for telling us, Phil. I tell you, there's another card for him. <laughs> Had a bit of a draw, Tuesday. I don't know where that's gone. I'm going to say 78. 
No, no, 92. 88? Yeah. So, Phil, just to... We're actually four out. Congleton, nine old course, two flags. Is, is that front nine, back no? Front yeah. nine and back nine? Yeah. So we're... Red's on the front, yellow's on the back. Right. And you've been here ten years? Yeah, and I still sometimes play the wrong flags. But I give it, honestly, if you're in the area, pop in and have a game. Greens are fantastic. I've not gotten in the hole yet, but the greens are fantastic. It's a lovely setting, isn't it? Yeah. That one. Yeah. I'm having a bit of Lord Mercy show here. Oh, yeah. Short game's going to come in quick. <coughs> These two have gone off giggling. Look at Steve. <laughs> we'll put one on the green now. Oh. Yeah. Then we'll have a bit of fun with him on the last two because we can't lose. No, but we could win 4-0, Phil. I yeah, hope but, you were calling me uh, there. Right, Phil, 88 yards. Put the heat on. I'm That's in trouble a beautiful shot. I'm in trouble. What is happening? Who's the eight handicapper here? I think it's you. <laughs> you all right, John? <laughs> <laughs> Phil, can I ask you a question? If you could ref a game again, yeah. what would that be? If I could ref a game again, it'd probably be the League Cup final, Aston Villa, Man United. You'd do that again? Yeah. For what reason? Um, I gave a penalty to Villa, I think to make it 1-0, and I should have sent off the Man United player. Vidic? Yes. So for me, that's one game I look back on and go, I cocked up there. The Villa fans absolutely still hate me now. Yeah, they need to I stop even go that. with a mask on when I go down there. Or... It's amazing, isn't it? I mean, when you think how long ago that was, yet the grudge is still held. Yeah. I mean, that's football, and you've got to accept that. Yeah. Now, that happened in the fifth minute. Yeah. Were you conscious the rest of the game of that no, decision? No, because I didn't know at the time, but I think Martin O'Neill rightly let me know at the end of the game after. I think they lost 2-1, didn't they? Yes. At the end of the game, and yeah, it wasn't a very nice. Even though it should be good walking up the steps. Get enjoy it one minute after that. Right, John, your teammate has just give you a license again, hasn't he? Oh no, there, push it straight. That's gone. Come on out. In between. Yeah, in between. Lie the land's done that, John. Uh, Always pushes it out if you've got that. Always right, pushes it. I mean I'm talking a good game, I'm not even <laughs> I'm getting a right whack in here. I need to sort myself out. What a most getting the getting the old cash out of the pocket, you know what I mean? Well we're chatting about cash, no one has cash no more or a wallet. Phil said he's got one of them card readers. Just tap it. Oh, just give it a he tap. He carries Phil, them, yeah. He wins every week. Phil, do you think I can fly this all the way? Don't tell him, Phil. They're putting a bit of jizz on it. Don't, uh, well, don't. I'm just trying, I think it should stop all the way. Shot. That could be the one. That is a cracking shot. What a great shot. Wonderful. Back in the game, I think. In. But do I don't trust given, him. Given, Let's have a nosy. He's given himself a chance there. Oh, that's good, isn't it? Yeah. yeah, we'll have a bit of that. They won't give it me, though, golf mates, I'll tell you. Phil, is that good? <laughs> <laughs> See there, Phil's not talking, he's going to be moving his lips. That's not a gimme. <laughs> Probably this side of the black. This guess. side of it? Yeah. Well, depends on the pace there. Phil, yeah. in summer, again, is this one of these what's fast? Yeah. yeah. Do you want it in or out, sir? Leave it in for me, please. I don't want to be short. <laughs> All right, Phil for birdie, again. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> Shot again, Phil. <laughs> Look at the grin. Never seen you so happy. John, in or out the flag, sir? No, in, leave it in for me, please. Thank you. That was good pace, that, Phil. Oh, I know what's going to come. You're going to come and turn up trumps in one of these holes. I can see it coming. That's a good putt. 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 <laughs> <laughs> <No>. <laughs> Should we give him that, John? <laughs> yeah, can I can have We'll that. give you that for a four. Oh, God. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Look how happy they are. Not said a word. I can see his teeth laughing, smiling. Have you got that card reader, Phil? <laughs> <laughs> I don't ever say it's a four all match. I'm too old down here at Congleton in Cheshire near Staffordshire. There's a yellow card for you and a yellow card for you. <laughs> right, golf mates, as always on these challenges, there's a shot scope 100 yard challenge which me and John decided not to go in. Is that right, John? We have decided that, because we can't hit the green, if you're honest. <laughs> so, leaderboard's up there. Phil, this is your hockey. There we go. Come on, Phil. Bang on 100 yards. Into the wind, or with the wind? No, with behind you. that. Just want to hit it. I'm loving this. Miles away. No, it's not. I'm going to go and measure that. Give me a minute, golf mates. And up there will be the measurement. How close Phil is 
to the pin. Uh, John, how far were that? Nine feet dead. You happy with that, Phil? Not really, no. Six foot would have been better. But you happy? You are, aren't you? Anyway, back to the match. Right, golf mates, here we go. Uh, Phil, if you're a commentator, what do you reckon of John's putt? I think it was superb. No energy wasted, straight in. And to make it 2-0, with two to play, you're up against it. So what we've got here is a great, oh, it's a risk and reward. It's 270 yard, but as a crow flies, 250. Probably about 250, yeah. Dog leg, right to left. Ditch running everywhere. It's, and water in front. Yes, so even I'm half, uh, I don't know what to do, I'm in shock. You've got to take it on. If you, yeah, but I'm if you two down. Left, you've got to, well, you've got to take it on, haven't you? Well, I can see the, what iron are you hitting there? You're done. I'm, I'm <laughs> gonna I was going to take a six, but I want to be a bit closer to put more pressure on you, so I'm going to take a five. Oh, drawing that. Stay there for the shot tracer. Phil, let me just say something. That's not bad. Absolutely class. <laughs> if you want to hear the full podcast, please get over to 442. We've got Phil sat down for two hours. We're going to hear some great stuff. We're on Instagram, Facebook and everything. What am I going to say, Phil? You've been trouble. golfing a lot in your retirement. <laughs> <laughs> Play some good golf, haven't you? Aye, I have not a clue what to do. Go for it. No. If you go for it, you'll be in trouble. You will lose the hour. Oh, Phil, no. what I am going to say, in these series, we forgot to say it before, me and John, we're going to make a donation to a charity. Yeah. Have you got a charity you'd like a donation go to? There's two, because I know here we're doing a charity, but also I was diagnosed with Parkinson's nearly three years ago. If we do a bit of half an hour... Should we do 50-50? Yeah. Yeah. 50-50. Yeah. How far is it to the water, Phil? I reckon about 2.30. Oh, is it that far, is it? Yeah, you're only going to get much run. I might be wrong. Right. Probably Say 200. Where is it? 208. 208. To the water, yeah? Yeah. What are you hitting with? Five? No, just this utility thing. British gas. Is that what it is? Shot, okay. John. Great that shot. Might be alright. The only thing with that, John, is if you've gone too far left, you ain't got a shot in. No, it's, I think no, it's... I think uh, I was in line with the water. Yeah, I yeah. think it's... I think it's you've a long way down. still got the tree over so we've got to be careful. Oh, OK, right. Take. If you go too far left, you're in trouble. Right. You're not going for it. You've not got any good news. No. <laughs> you said I were a caddy once, so I'm going to try and go with the odds. But... Keep yourself in the game. Oh, first of first all, you played it well and I was a render. Second all, just class. Because you would have given me that putt, wouldn't you, John? Great shot. It's open there, isn't it? Yeah, good way in, that is. It's a full shot in anyway, a bit. Oh. It's that. opened the hole up. So the modern game phil how do you think you would have caught with var yeah uh, i think i'd have got a few more decisions right because obviously you can go to var now if something's obviously wrong um i don't know i know we've got to embrace technology and things have got to move forward but i suppose a bit like you john you, you get you say to yourself do we really need this VAR? can't we just play football as it's supposed to be played and I'm not a great fan, but I understand why it's in. You, you can understand why it's in, but for me anyway, I think it's slowing the game up. I yeah. think it's taking away power to a certain extent from the referee as well. I, th I think as a referee, you make a decision, you, such as you give a penalty, and you know you've got a backup. If, if, if it's wrong, you can overturn it. Yeah. Well, when they come off the pitch and go and look at the screen, yeah. you know it's going to get changed. Well, It's just about nine times out of ten, that decision's now getting changed. So you know. Yeah, I think there was one where somebody said, no, I'm sticking with my original decision, and good for him. But if somebody's asked you to go and look at the screen, is it in the back of your mind... Is that the lean on pressure already? Yeah, they're because more straight less away they're telling you, have you got this wrong? So they're pretty much saying to you, listen, yeah, in that ain't right. You're second doubting you, aren't you? That's yeah. not right, change your decision. But it's got to be Is that the right way to referee, though? I don't know, because as a referee, when you see that and somebody's actually going to go and watch the screen, you're thinking, well, they've had time to look at it for how many different angles. I'm going to take about 10 seconds, probably a bit longer, to look at it and go, yeah, I'll go with you, it's wrong. But look at the, look at the point of view from a player even, right? Now, a player scores, yeah. doesn't celebrate now. The first thing he does, stops. Everybody stops. Is he looking at the screen. Is a foul before? Now, yeah. I'm standing there now, and it seems to be getting longer and longer for the decisions to come through. And you know, I'm standing there for maybe two minutes. The crowd, are, the crowd are all now on tender hooks. The players are standing there, and then they go, go. And yeah, it's not the same now, is no, it? No, So you said you supported Port Vale. Yeah. So when you're a ref, do you have to, like, tell everyone who you support? Yeah, you, you have to, before the season starts, you have to, you get, if you're training with somebody or support somebody, 
or you've got family members who've got season tickets, you have to put that on. Right. So you'll never go there. Well, no, no. You might not support them, but if you've got, say, me son supporting Man United, yeah. I could never go there. If you've got any conflict of interest at yeah, all you, with you a can't. team, you it's, cannot referee. It can't be involved. It, no, it's just one of them things that we've always done and I've always put Port Vale. Listen to me now. I don't ask for nothing. It's nearly Christmas. Get over to that other channel, subscribe. Phil's going to be brilliant. I know he is. He's good at golf <laughs> and he's going to be great at these questions because John's great. And, as you can see, I'm getting my words mixed up. John's a great question. And remember, though, it's Phil. Ask her. <laughs> What's my name? Yeah. Phil. Mark. Dowd. Joe. What did I call you? Dodd. <laughs> Ken. It's up to you. You know the course better than me. Well, we've got to go over that tree with yours. I think it's just a chip on and a putt for a beardy, isn't it? Are there ducks in that pond there? We don't see them. <laughs> <laughs> Trying everything. Uh, right, it'd be me to go then. I, and, him, and him to go. Yeah, yeah but I'm going to put. This is where I've got to put the Jockey Wilson in. We yeah. have. The dart. Got yeah. to, got you've, to. You've got to put it close because John's going to put this next to the pin. John. I am. 80 yards. <laughs> 2v1 here, I've got to get it close. You want to be landing that 85. What a Wilson, what a gorgeous hole in it, isn't it? A beautiful Lovely. golf hole. Come on, Liam, make a game. Make a game of it. <laughs> 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 That's another one. I'll be, if I was a fourth official, these days, you know, everyone's a bit, sit down, son, sit down, hang you, hang you, right, let's have a good game. I know it's off topic, but then, if you're a fourth official, you're just getting it from both ears, aren't you? A bit like I feel today with your handicaps. It's not great. It's on the green, but I'll, it's not great. I'll resod that for you. You're okay. Stay there. Has it gone over that pond, John? You're good. You're good. What it got... pond? I'll show you in a minute, Phil. No, we'll show you in a minute. You're good. 20 feet to the right. You're good. <sighs> nearly, nearly. Good distance, good distance, Very as I say. Distance. Everyone likes the distance, right? Very good distance, that. I thought this would be a right close game. I didn't, I didn't left... see this coming, to be honest. You've left yourself an uphill putt there, though. That's good. Yours is getting trickier and trickier now, actually. We only need a half to win, don't we? Yeah. Oh, see, these can count as well. Look so. here, and we're in the drop zone. Right, right golf mates took John's ball. Quirky, <coughs> isn't it? It's, just, it's not as easy as you think, obviously, with all the yellow stakes and the pond. No, it's not. I think if you let the water get in your head, it's not easy. Shot, John. I'll do. Oh, hello. Hello, the parrot talk. Hello, I'll do. <laughs> Jesus Christ. You'll better that, Phil. Huh? You will better that. Do you reckon? Yes, I do. That's Great awesome. Shot. He's on fire. Lovely. Lucky. There's nothing, no luck about that. You all right, John? I'm very well, thank you. <laughs> good you. Phil, having a good day? You OK? Um, I think that's just put... Unless you put this in, Liam, which is highly unlikely, I think that's <laughs> just the final nail. <laughs> highly unlikely. Who comes up with these Come games? On, you can do it. <laughs> what a great shot, mate. That was an hard shot, that. So he said today, John, yep. this, is not, this is my bogey hole, this is my bogey shot, and he's gone bang. You two could be torn to gross here after three holes. Right, yeah. gentlemen, you're very <laughs> close. Stood on it. Are you having it in or out? Sorry? Well, I'll, I'll sort it for you. And I'm we'll, going to have it out. Well, we're putting it back in for us. Are you having it back in? Yeah, because we're downhill. Yeah, we're a back-end team. Right, am I still one down? <coughs> You're two down, you oh, know is it. it. Yeah, you know. Keep trying, You're though. Two it sounds down, good. But you could be three after this one. Sounds good. Get it to the hole, Liam. Get it to the hole. Yeah, it's uphill, and I'll be honest, Liam, it is a bit harder than you think. There you go. Give it a go. Good read, Liam. I'm going to give you that. Oh, what? No, I am. What? I'll I'm mark gonna... it when you fall in. I'm going to give you that. Yeah, OK. Right, so I'm getting it in my head now. I'm going to have come up with something like double or quits. Yes. Why well, do I think it's here? You think I know I'm against edge. you. What? Hey, hey, don't listen to the European caddy. You know something, but I you think know. I won that by default. It must have been a lottery ticket. I'll go that way. And in I'll fact, go the other way. I'm going to go straight. Yeah, go Let's straight. see what happens and then. <laughs> We've got the far. Right, this is for go 200 gross. So I this, repeat, this, so this is not to, not to be short, yeah? No, yeah, just go straight. <laughs> yes! <laughs> right, I'm going to have to be honest here. I want to say something, I don't want to be disrespectful. Are we going for double or quits? Of course we are. Yeah. I said earlier on, shouldn't take me long, beat age concern. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm going to say it now because that's, uh, yeah, I deserve everything I get. These lads are 200 gross playing awesome. Phil, what all are we going to do double a quits on? We'll do it on the ninth. Ninth hole. Uh, again, 
give this man some love. What a belter, and him, take the potter off him. <laughs> it's playoff all sorts. You're technically a fiver each in the green. Have I got to win this all just to get my money back? Yes. And half if I lose it, you two are on. Good, is it? Half's not good. No, half's, it's used, it's yeah. finished. Yeah. Right, 380 yard, proper long haul uphill. I'll take my time on this one. What a goal shot that is. Look at the shot trace with Baby Fade right on the house. Is that position here, Phil? That is better than I could have placed it. What? Are you playing? Oh, do you always play this good, Phil? No. Or are you bringing no. your A game? No. I had to tell you, Sunday, I was awful. Phil, I don't know what to say. I keep saying good shot, good shot. Phil, I'm going to say it again. Great shot. So there's a hole, what we can see right at the top. Yeah, you see where that other mark is? It goes round the corner to the right. Right. OK. Anything left, you've got a shot in. Corey Paven on the tee, putting God. Corey Paven. That's a blast, isn't it? Blast from the past. Yeah. That is a cracking shot. He's absolutely lab it. That'll be down in the dip. That'll be down in the dip. It's gone. It is down the dip, isn't it? Yeah. Can I borrow that teacup? So the comments, you're at home thinking Phil's actually a great lad and he's not called Dodd, he's Dodd. <laughs> John's a bandit with a short stick and uh, I've got a big gob. Not it, a good shot. No, it is. You're actually about to take this shot knowing if it's not in the fairway, you may as well go home. Right, concentrate now. Come back, Dennis Law. That is a cracking shot. You've answered Absolutely. the critics. That's a wonderful shot, Liam. Well played. Did that hit the tree and go back in the rock? Is that hit the tree? Seriously? No. Did it not? No. No, he went straight past me. That's a great that shot. He did shot. tell me that was a line, and I like to think I did that on purpose, but I will play for a draw and end up with a fade. That's how honest I am. These are wonderful people. Honestly, they are. I think we've got a choice. Ken Dodd. <laughs> Ken Dodd. We can either play yours. That. Or... 137, 140, Phil. Liam, you're, you're severely me. above your feet. And? Good luck. <laughs> so it means a lot. They're having a right argument. Which balls are taking? Now they're taking fills because it's a better angle into the green. I've got a vicious one there. Dad's army are buzzing here, I'm telling you. They're buzzing. I mean, seven. Seven. If you can find your seven. There's your seven. Hit it steady. Did you check then? You didn't trust me. No, he didn't trust you. There you go. That's that is. John, is that the first bad shot? Four oh. fall, first bad <laughs> it's shot. It's the first shot that didn't quite go where he wanted, that's for sure. Red well, flag. Then again, I've got a tricky shot there. I'm not going to be able to give myself a yardage. Red flag. Yeah. That is brilliant. That's the right club, oh, John yes. McGinley. That'll do. That might just be a little chip and put. Yeah. It's in the right direction. Oh, I'll give over. You two shouldn't be fist pumping at your ages. Jesus, chicken and rice, you sick of the bung. He's like, and he went, boom. <laughs> <laughs> Phil's going to take a look. You're a bit undecided with the two clubs. I'm, I'm just, I'm going for that marker. Right. Can what I do just, you reckon, Phil? I've can, got. Can 100. I just say, don't be right of the marker. What are you, what are you thinking of hitting? I've pitch got a wedge. gap or an easy pitch. I'd go easy pitch. Yeah. Have you won on tours, Caddy? Don't be right of the marker, though. <laughs> no, I might. Yeah, but get me yardage right, John. No, but I've won this match. No, it's in the bunker if you go right. Is that a good bad one? I think that's a good bad one, yeah. It's a There's bit a thin, wasn't it? There. Short. There's a bunker short, though. You might just have avoided it. You get a wee bit of mud there. No, I just thinned it, looking Something. for it. Just a tricky one, isn't it? Mm. Yeah. Do you think it's harder, though? It is harder when you don't see the hole. Well, I just trusted, I trusted that line. But I think no, you'll be surprised when you get There's some there. excuses coming here. You'll be no, surprised. I'm not had a chipping in ages. Let's have one now. <laughs> It'll hurt if it's me on the green and you two short with my absolute terrible shot. I tell you what. No, that's you. I've got a fit, yeah. That's. What are you playing, John? I can oh, see it's you. Oh, no. <laughs> well, I don't deserve go on, do I? I don't deserve go on. Phil's a bandit. John is. Liam's, uh, well. Right. Chipping. Stranger things have happened. Expect the unexpected. It's a great effort. Oh, that's ran on. Not a gimme though, is it? No, it's <laughs> certainly not. Is that ten? Is that a ten or each? So it's twenty quid. No. No, it's only a five or each. Five or each? No, it's double a quid, so isn't it? Oh, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Do you want to go first, though? It's up to you, mate. Well, there's your, there's the marker. You pick. Oh, the proper you've, Texas scramble in it now. You've showed me the way every time. Why do I feel like you're going to make this pot? Do you reckon, John? Grandstand finish. Oh, what are we looking at? 
that foot outside the left. You'd think they're not short of a bob or two, these two. All this for a tenner. Oh, it is. It goes both ways, doesn't it? I reckon. I would say left, yeah. It just well, seems a bit faster, this one. Hmm. Oh, you don't, Phil, your mate's here, don't worry, innit? Yeah, yeah. He'll put it in the circle of love, and you've got that big putt then. You say circle of love, if this gets to a gimme, it's done. I've got to win, haven't I? <laughs> got to hope he has some sort of attack. What a setting, what a beautiful hole behind. Ped it hard. Ooh. You just never know in life. You never know, and no, I'll try do somewhere. Never know. Is that any way, Liam? Just a tad, sir, just a tad, but again, if I miss this, it's, as the Japanese say, pay up. Say an hour. Right, hey. here we go. They want to rub the icing into my eyes here. Light the candles. <laughs> Miss it. You have the laugh. I have been schooled by Dad's Army, age concern, call it what you want, but the better golfers won. See you soon, golf mates. <laughs>